Hey guys, it's your girl Booney, and welcome to The Breakdown, your YouTube headquarters for all things responsible and ratchet. Hey y'all, hey, it's your girl Booney, and welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time here, hey, hope you stick around and subscribe to our channel. If you've been here before, welcome back. I'm glad to have you. All right, for this video, uh, we're gonna do a little Booney review and unboxing. I never thought I'd be the person to do unboxing videos. Am I uncool now? I hope I'm still cool, but whatever. Uh, this weekend, I went out and I had no plans to do this. I had already shopped the Nordstrom Anniversary Sale. Um, what did I get from Nordstrom Anniversary Sale? Uh, I got a, a, a cologne, some finally got the Spanx um, leather, faux leather leggings. Got a pair of those. What else did I get? Oh, I got cologne that and two pairs of boots. One pair of boots still has not shipped yet. And I got them on the 16th, which makes me nervous that they're going to cancel and still evading me were a pair of fry boots that I wanted. I've been wanting these boots for like the last three years, but I don't want to pay like 400 bucks for them. And they're usually like one something in a Nordstrom anniversary sale, but they were gone in my size very quickly. So I was pretty uh, sad and bummed about that. Uh, but the reason we're here is because I did a, um, uh, a, uh, a splurge purchase at Nordstrom this weekend. And so I am so excited to share with you. What did I get? Oh my God. It's like my first Joe Malone, uh, perfume cologne purchase. I was so excited. The packaging is super adorable and super cute. And so let's go and uh, i'm gonna share with you all what it is i got i thought it was so cute like they really took the time to package it really well um the saleswoman at the nordstrom counter i went to the nordstrom store here in my city and she was super sweet she was not pushy and first she gave me some little goodies because i like had never even encountered or purchased from this brand before and so I was uh, trying pretty much everything and she was so sweet and letting me test and spray and, and telling me how to layer. So she gave me the wild uh, blue bell. So, oh my God, I'm officially a YouTuber. I'm using my hand. So we got this one, a uh, nice sample. And this is a pretty healthy sample size. Like you can really get good use of like to see if this is a, uh, a fragrance that you would like to keep using. So I'm really am impressed with that. And not only did she give me one, she gave me two, but before we move to that next one, uh, this London Wild Bluebell Cologne, it says it has vibrant fragrances that has a delicate sense of bluebell and floral lily. So, hmm, it's okay. Um, I'm not a big, a huge floral person, so this video is probably going to be shocking when we get to the big purchase, but I'll try it out since I got it for free. So this one, and then the second one I got, I actually really love this one. Here we go with the YouTube hand again. Oh my God, I never thought I would be doing this, uh, but this is the Nectarine Blossom and Honey. This one, oh God, I love this one so much. I probably will go back and buy it. <laughs> But I was appreciative that she gave me this sample. The sample is 0.3 fluid ounces. So we got those two. Excited. The Nectarine Blossom, it's very fruity. And Nectarine is like my favorite um, stone fruit. I am like, I probably will buy it. I should have just brought it then. But I think because I brought a one, I just felt like, did I want to dive in? This was my first purchase with this brand. So did I just want to hop right into it with two big bottles? So no. Um, here's the packaging, super, I can smell it through the box, but here's the packaging, super cute. I love the attention to detail. You can reuse this box and I will. We're going to slip this bow off because there, bow. all right, so the bow is gone and now we open her up. You can literally smell it through the box and this is it. This is her. It is the one point something ounces. <laughs> no, this is the um, 50 milliliter Scarlet Poppy Intense from Joe Malone. Oh, guys, this smells so good. The sales lady at the Nordstrom counter really sold it. I kept coming back to it. 
Oh God, I just just gonna spray myself right now. Um, <clears throat> like I have a mouth. Ugh. But it has um, the poppy floral seeds, and so it is a very bold blossom. It has some rich richness to this scent, but it also has a base note of tonka bean, which brings some warmth to this fragrance. You have some tobacco, vanilla, which I love. They also said it's notes of almond within this. And then you also have amber, um, is what the sales lady said. And so it has some, some kind of powdery top notes to it. Um, I just feel like for me, I'm not a big floral person. And so this was like a floral scent that I can rock because it also had that a little bit of muskiness with that tobacco and vanilla. It gave you some oomph to it, you know. It, I didn't smell like a garden, but it's like, oh, what is that? Oh, like, what is that? Oh, so yeah. And then the bottle was pretty. The bottle was super cute. And so, like I said, you could smell it through the box. And um, I was not intending on buying anything. This is my first purchase with Joe Malone. Um, I probably will go back and get that Nectarine one as well. But in case you're wondering what this set me back, I'm going to go ahead and tell you because I have no problem sharing how much I spent. Because <laughs> I feel like more people should share um, the cost of things. Because I'll be looking sometimes like, how y'all be affording this? But anywho, we're not in each other's pockets. But this bottle the small bottle was 138 you can get a larger 100 milliliter bottle for 196 so yes um now that i just sprayed it and it's mm, mm, it just smells so good i'm like i probably should have got the big bottle because i am gonna wear this it smells so good i feel like it's a good scent to transition from the summer into the fall if you're someone who wears your summer scents and and your fall scents because it definitely has that extra um from the tobacco and the vanilla but the floral is light. I'm not a big floral uh, cologne wearer. And it's also um, a big deal that I even brought this big bottle because I am a true travel size rollerball girl because I'm just like, sometimes I get over a scent and I'm not gonna finish the whole bottle. And so travel size has let me get to try a lot, a lot of different types of perfumes and colognes. Um, at a like fraction of the price. So instead of paying, you know, $150, some colognes now, the good ones are like 500 bucks. You can get a sample size or a smaller size for maybe $130. So yeah, let me know. If you're a fan of Joe Malone, let me know in the comments. I would love to know which uh, scent is your favorite. If you have this one as well, let me know if you love it or you hate it. Um, but yeah, I can't wait to try this, wear this, and try some more of this great brand. So that is it, guys. If you enjoyed this review and this video, be sure to subscribe. Uh, click that link. You can follow us over on Instagram at The Boonie Breakdown. All right. Until next time.